Yo, what's poppin'? Today, we're gonna be opening up the Premium Dragon Pulse Collection from Shining Fates, and we're gonna be opening up at least four, no, not at least, absolutely, exactly four booster packs from Battle Styles. We're gonna go ahead and be pushing our luck, trying to see if we can go ahead and get the Zard or the Titar or literally anything else that deserves to be in the collection. What deserves to be in the collection? What doesn't deserve to be in the collection? Except no boss's orders. But anyways, if you like this content, if you want to go ahead and stick around for the hunt, please make sure to go ahead and like and subscribe. It helps a ton. And you get to go ahead and get notified when we go ahead and do this again. But let's see if we can go ahead and get this video to 10 likes. You know, like that shouldn't be too hard. Maybe, maybe not 10 likes. Let's get there. Show me that you care. Show me that you believe in the cards. The heart of the cards. But anyways, let's actually get into the packs and let's see what this is all about. So I'm super happy that I was able to go ahead and get this. And to be honest, I've had it in my closet for a bit. And for the most part, I just try to figure out like when I'm ready to open it. Maybe there's been a Zard in here the entire time, maybe. But today we're ready to go ahead and find out what exactly is inside of here. So this collection actually comes with a jumbo size card for Dragapult and luckily, ta-da, 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 stop being so bright. But thankfully, we have the partner collection binder that uh, honestly, I haven't bought any of those packs at all. So I've just been using it for my cool purpose of putting in whatever I want. Oi. We got Pikachu. We got Pikachu, Meowth, another Pikachu. We got that Pikachu sandwich. And then here's where we're gonna go ahead and put Dragapult. Look at this. This thing is enormous. It is amazing. There we go. Wonderful. So this is actually laid out super, super organized and like, yeah, I guess there's a reason why you call this premium. So my question is, does this affect uh, the pull rate of, you know, of these packs? Like they seem awfully nice. And then of course this comes with the coin. Look at that. That is heckin' cool. And play. I'm gonna use this as a pog. Be a real pog champ. And then there's a the shiny Dragapult V. It looks super nice. However, it looks a little bit damaged, a little bit nicked right near the top. Don't know how easy it is to go ahead and see, but yeah, it's not, it's not the best. And then here we have the Dragapult V Max card. Uh, it looks really good, but the centering, again, it's a little bit thick on the left. Don't know how easy it is to tell, but I can see it, but regardless, uh, again, super happy to have this as part of the collection. So into the sleeve you go. We have seven packs, which is kind of a lot. Uh, and we have all this art right here. Uh, honestly, like always, I feel like as a superstition, as a superstitious sort of step. I shouldn't go ahead and do this, but I'm doing it anyways. Going full on Charizard at the very beginning to get the Charizards out of the way. Uh, Toxtricity can go in the front. And I would like a Corviknight sandwich. Or actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and alternate in this direction. Okay. This is what I would like as the order. So it's going to be Charizard, Charizard, Toxtricity, Corviknight, Dragapult, Corviknight, Dragapult. All right. So that's what we're going to go ahead and get into. And let's start. All right. So let's go ahead and see, is this going to actually open nicely? Oh my gosh. This opens up so nicely. This is going to be a good opening. And also, I forgot everything that there was in this set besides uh, Charizard, but 
honestly, like shiny anything would be very cool because it's the Shining Fates packs. And this whole time, I'm pretty much going to be trying to avoid looking at the code cards. And for the most part, I'm keeping those for myself just because I do like to go ahead and enter them into the game. Like I don't actually play, but I feel like this is something that I would need to go ahead and do, you know, if I actually do want to play. Did I do this right? Ah, uh, okay. I did do it right, but we forgot to guess. Okay, either way, let's go. All right, so we have Psychic Energy, Dark Tricks, Rusted Shield, Cramorant, Evian Gelatin, Kiafont, Cacnea, Nicket, what's the reverse? Not it, not yet, reverse, Weasel, reverse. Eevee, okay, this I'm like super, super stoked about because it is Eevee and to actually have that as a reverse. And what do we have in the back? Oh, oh, heck yeah. No lies. Okay, I had forgotten about this card, but I'm actually incredibly excited to go ahead and get this card for a few reasons. One, it's the secret rare. It's the rainbow secret rare. I have never pulled a card like this because like I recently joined back in or I recently came back to Pokemon cards. So this is super cool on one hand. On the second hand, this is the cake Pokemon. This is cake. And this is a weird stretch, but like Steve Aoki, that's a person who also came into Pokemon somewhat recently, maybe, maybe not. And music festivals is something that I would go to often enough. Steve Aoki, he would go out and play and literally throw cake at the crowd, like literally at someone. Cake from a distance of someone. Imagine getting this sign. I think that would be the coolest thing. You know, screw taking a czar to go out and get that sign by Aoki. This is the card. Anyways, hopeful, wishful thinking. Heck yeah. Premium collection. How you be that cool? All right, the centering is kind of crummy. Not gonna lie on that one. Uh, everything else is great on it. What a way to start opening up the Charizard pack and getting the secret rainbow rare. That literally has never happened to me. I'm like on my way to the moon right now. Bring me back, bring me back. Like how can we top that though? I mean, thankfully this isn't like a booster box or anything with, uh, you know, any odds like that. Unless there are specific odds to any of these collection sets. Three, four, and I want to go ahead and guess. Fire. Darkness. All right, so dark energy. Floatzel, Rusted Shield, Rodom, Cacnea. More Pico, more Peco, Snami, Snam, Horsey, Sidra, Nicket. Whoa! Whoa! I feel like I need to be a little bit more careful when I handle my cards because we've got a rainbow rare in here. Yveltal, Yveltal. This is I can cool. I already have Reshiram, but that one's the centering on that is not good. From a distance, the centering on this looks really good. I'm actually super, super excited. This is only pack two out of seven. What do we have in the back? Galarian Weezing, Holographic. Heck yeah. So I'll go ahead and make the safe call. No Zards in any of these packs. Why? Because these have already been very good. If I stopped right now, like I'd be happy. Should I stop right now? Now we go going for broke. So no lies, I would actually be quite happy to go out and try to send this in for grading, but it's not gonna be a 10. And I'm j basing that on just by like the tiniest whitening on like that corner. Very hard to see, but like the centering on this looks really good in my opinion. Like, oh man, how do you, how do you get cards that perfect? Okay, so as a secondary goal, you know, just like not be thinking about the Zard. Like shiny Arc Zolt would be great. I think that's what I want. Three and then four. 
and I would like to guess what a we got steel. All right, so steel energy, rusted shield, Rodom, Team Yell Towel, Grookey, Snami Snom, Spin a Rack, More Pico, More Peco, Rowlet, Reverse, Dark Tricks, and what do we have in the back? Yan Mega? Boss's orders, no, no. Man, that smell. Like our luck had to stop sooner or later. And you only have seven packs. Three, four. And for this, I would like to guess. Darkness. Psychic. All right, psychic energy. Rusted sword. Rodom. Blackie. Grookey. Nicket. Choodle. More Pico, more Peco, Eevee, and Gelatin. We got Galarian Meowth. If y'all don't know, Meowth is definitely one of my faves. Like it kind of wasn't for a long time, but because of life, yes. Meowth all the way, yes. I forgot that this was one of the shinies in the set. I'm incredibly excited. I love this. When I was playing the game, Sword and Shield, I caught one. I nicknamed it Scotch Bright because it's a furry ball and it's steel. Heck yes. Yes to everything. The centering is so bad, but heck yes to everything minus that centering. This one's going into the binder. What do we have in the back? Yon Mega. We have all Canyon. All right, so we've got three packs left. Here we go with the Dragapult from the Dragapult Premium Collection. Three, four. I would like to guess Lightning. Fire. Okay. So we've got Fire Energy, Team Yell Towel, Rusted Shield, Cramorant, Weasel, Nicket, Trapinch, Snom, and the Reverse. Nope, no reverse. Gustler in the reverse. Whoa! Whoa, are you kidding me? I get a second chance to go out and evaluate which one is better, but this one is obviously not the better one, but very cool. I had none. I had zero amazing rares for Yveltal. Yveltal. Now I've got two. What do we have in the back? Hey! We've got a hollow Luxray, and this looks awesome. Okay, yeah, this is not the good. This is not the good Yveltal, but I mean, why wouldn't I be happy about these? At this point, there absolutely can't be any awesome hits. Like there just can't be. Like that was awesome. I should stop now and I should go ahead and just keep these boosters and just sit on them forever, right? Not today, Zerg. Two, three, four. Let's guess. Leaf, grass energy, fire. All right, so we've got fire energy. Luxio, rusted sword, Floatzel. Trapinch, Yanma, Yanmega, the Weasel, Grookey, Kifont, the Reverse. What? We got another shiny, shiny alert, shiny alert, shiny alert. We got a Drakezolt. I wanted the Arctazolt, but no matter. This is still pretty damn awesome. We got the Arctazolt, the centering. Who cut you? And then in the back, Yan Mega finally after calling it out. Yeah. Like this is awesome. In all honesty, I haven't opened up too many Shining Fates products. So to actually open up, um, you know, like a premium collection where it's like seven packs. Like these have been really good pulls, like really, really awesome pulls. 
And with that, this is the final pack for Shining Fates. So let's go ahead and see where does this take us? Three, four. It's not gonna be it, but I'm gonna say fire because it's been fire twice. And this whole this whole set has been fire. Darkness, of course. Alright, so dark energy, Luxio, Rusted Sword, Rodom, Choodle, more Pico, more Peko, Yanma, Grookey, Nicket, the reverse, Trepinch, and in the back. Professor's research. Okay. Considering like how well everything has gone, understandable. Okay. Super okay. We okay with that. So that was it as far as all the booster packs that came out of that premium collection. And now let's go for a couple of battle styles just to go ahead and see where our luck is at. I know that this isn't gonna be any kind of good, but I mean, you need to open stuff in order to go ahead and see if you're gonna get cool stuff. That's the law of the land. Also on a separate note, if you enjoy live content, I do stream on twitch.tv slash every Tuesday and Thursday. And at the moment we're playing, but of course the new Pokemon Snap, I've never played it, or at least I never really, never really had an N64 back in the day, but things are different now. We've all got switches in which case Pokemon Snap is the business. If that sounds like your flavor, come along. Let's go ahead and take only full screen photos of Pokemon. So we're just gonna go straight, you know, like just straight in a row. Three, four, let's go. Steel, water. All right, so water energy, Girder, Seedra, Fan of Waves, Mankey, Sizzlipede, Baltoy, Timber, Corefish Core, please be a reverse. No, Single Strike Scroll of Scorn, and what do we have in the back? Lorantis, okay, so this is a rare that I believe that I've never had. Also, as far as upcoming sets, what do y'all think about EV Heroes? Are y'all as excited as I am? Who even is going to get that ev evolution set? I would like to, but I think everyone would like to. But who actually is? What are your feelings on it? Let me know. One, two, three, four. Let's say steel. Grass. God damn. Grass. Escape rope. Tower of Waters. Luxio. Mr. Mime, Onyx, Spiro, Sizzlipede, Shinx in the reverse, Vivian, Vivillon, Vivian, and in the back we have Claydol. Claydol. Yeah, so that's really neat. You can definitely tell uh, when you're pulling, uh, or at least you can definitely tell uh, the pull rates that they've changed. We're in a different so we're in a different state of pull rate at this point. One, two, three, four. Fighting. Lightning. Lightning energy. Single strike style mustard. Full art trainer would be awesome right now. Golbat. <clears throat> Bruno. Esper. Shinx. Blipbug. Ponyard. Mankey in the reverse. Bronzor, and in the back we've got Mian Shao. Oof, oof, that battle style though. We've been spoiled with Shining Fates and then we're taking a step back into the real world with battle styles and these pull rates, these realistic pull rates. All right, final pack. What is the last pack going to be? The energy is going to be fire. Steel. Are you kidding me? All right. Steel energy. Karkul. Dottler. Pignite. Sizzlipede. Shinx. Cacnea. Ponyard. Timber. The reverse. 
Electivire. Nice. That's a rare too. That is a rare too. To, so to have that as um, you know, as a reverse, kind of really cool in my opinion. And in the back, what do we have? Mr. Rhyme. Wah, 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 wah. On the plus, what this does do is that it makes the rest of the battle styles packs that I do have. Hopefully it means that there, there are better things in there. Maybe, we'll see. All right, but those are all the packs for today. What did you think? But before we go, let's go ahead and take a final recap and see what exactly did we even pull today? All right, so here's the recap. We have Vivian, Reverse Hollow, Dartrix, Reverse Hollow, Trapinch, Reverse Hollow, Bronzor, Reverse Hollow, Single Strike, Scroll of Scorn, Electivire, Rare, but Reverse Hollow, Evian, Gelatin, Reverse Hollow. This one I'm the most happiest about, as far as like all these uh, Reverse Hollows. We have Luxray Holographic. Look at that shine, it's amazing. Galarian Weezing, always a pleasure, always a pleasure. Then the baby shiny Galarian Meowth. Baby shiny Drake Zult. The amazing rare Yveltal times two. Then we've got the Dragapult V shiny from the promo or from the box and the Dragapult V Max from the box. And finally that Alchemy V Max rainbow rare pie in the sky. Pie in the sky, pie in the sky, cake in your face. And yeah, that was all she wrote. Honestly, what did you think about these pulls? I don't want to sway you, but <sighs> thanks so much for watching. If you like this, please make sure to go out and check out any of these other videos. But until then, I will see you at the next one. Today, we're going to be opening up the Dragapult Premium Collection from Shining Fates. I need to sneeze. <sighs> Today, we're going to be opening up the Dragapult Premium Collection for